Hi, my name is Miriam, and I'm the team lead for Generate RNA, a project where we examine multiomics data using generative networks. There are multiple ways to explore the cell landscape. Assays like ChIP-seq and ATT-seq provide insight into chromatin accessibility, while single-cell RNA-seq can reveal the transcriptional state of cells. We previously couldn't explore these states in conjunction with each other, since running one assay would destroy the cell, preventing us from carrying out any further analysis. This is where SNARE-seq comes in. Recent advances in single-cell technology has allowed us to obtain transcriptome and chromatin accessibility from single cells. This allows us to explore those states in relation to each other. The only tricky part is to develop models and algorithms that can analyze and understand this treasure trove of data. Generative models are one of the most promising approaches towards this goal. Generative models are a class of neural networks that aim to learn the true distribution of the training set so as to generate new data points from this distribution with some variations. Here's an example of a generative model. Here, a generative model was used to translate an image of a horse to a zebra and vice versa. There are many types of generative models, but we will be aiming to build a solution that focuses on integrating biological priors. This is to make sure we can build a robust model that can effectively translate or explore the relation between different data types. We welcome any developers or biologists with interest in machine learning or epigenetics to help us explore this compelling problem. Thank you.